Founded December 1, 1942, Marine Attack Squadron 311 has participated in many historic conflicts, such as the Battle of Okinawa, the Vietnam War, and Operation Iraqi Freedom. Continuing to make history, VMA-311 is expecting to depart Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni and rejoin the 31st Marine Expeditionary Unit to provide close air support in case of an attack. As far as affecting Operation Pacific as a whole, the uh, VMA-311 coming on board to support the 31st MU, just uh, we're, we're here to keep uh, you know, a uh, well-known presence in the uh, Pacific region. Uh, as well as with any other units. It's also given us the ability to uh, work hand-in-hand -hand with the MAGTAP and uh, you know, really integrate and get everybody on the same page so that when game day comes, we're actually ready to go. AVAB Harrier is an amazing aircraft. It's, uh, there's no other jet in the world like it. It really brings a unique dynamic uh, to aviation. The VSOL uh, capability is amazing. It's, you know, the fir first time you come in in a Harrier and uh, you're able to slow down to zero knots and stop and look down at the ground and, uh, you know, actually land your jet onto a certain point. Joining the 31st MU allows the squadron to participate in unique opportunities. What our unit can get from transitioning from a MU with them being here on land would be a lot of uh, uh, vertical takeoff landings on the boat, a lot of different uh, training opportunities that would be different from being on land. During the Korean War, VMA-311 earned the nickname Tomcats. Reporting from Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni, Japan, I'm Lance Corporal Calvin Hilt.